music is too loud. Well, now it's not. But not sure who's watching, but welcome, welcome. I'm going to be playing. I was always, I almost said Mini Egg Mansion, but no, it's Zach McCracken today. Actually, I'm pause the music. It's really loud. I mean, it ended already, so. Pause it. Pause. But, yep. Minimize. Today, I'm gonna be playing Zach McCracken and Alien Mindbenders. Um. Yeah, let's jump right in. I'm gonna be playing it for the Commodore 64, by the way. If this works. Okay. I am emulating it because it's easier than setting up the Commodore 64 and hooking it up to the computer and so on and so forth. Alright, that crash screen is way too loud. Um, now I gotta switch to side A, uh, side one. So, I actually need my controller. But yeah, this game came out a little bit after Maniac Mansion, and um, it's a pretty good game. It's pretty good. It's the second point and click game I played in my life. Not in my life when I was growing up, I should say. Um, but yeah, it's a really good game. Hopefully, you guys will like it. And yeah, Zach, 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 what I'm going to do with you? But boss, I will never win a. Oh man, I don't even know how to say that word. Plutzer? Working for this sleazy tabloid? Tabloid? I'm sick of making up stupid stories. Then make up stories that aren't stupid. Just look, do this last feature, and then you can write your novel. Here's your ticket to Seattle. I want more on that vicious two-headed squirrel that's been attacking campers. Oh, alright. Oh, and while you're there, the first UFO sighting happened on Mount Rainier 50 years ago. What's up, DH Comp? Write it up too. Hmm. Tableau reporter strangles boss over lousy assignment. What was that? Nothing, boss. Let me actually fix my windows really quick while all this happens. Okay. Hopefully I didn't mess up the the game. Cause when I alt tab, when I press on another window, it messes it up. Later that night, Zach's in bed alone. Again. The music for this game is really good. The intro is really good. That's why I like the Commodore 64 one. Zack McCracken and the Alien Mindbenders. Created by this and designed by. Oh, that's going too fast. Hey, that's me. Tableau reporter spaces out. style is a little bit different from Mania Function because this game obviously came out later in the years. I 
Not that long ago. Maybe like a year or two ago after. I mean, you're punching. It's a lot slower. Than on the Commodore. This Kong PM version theme is epic. I don't know. Like for me, the Commodore 64 has the best intro. Like, hands down. Alright, I gotta switch to side 2. Maybe David Fox will see this and he's like, you know what? Maybe I should remake Zack and Maniac. Well, he needs Ron Gilbert's uh, permission to do Maniac, I think. Wow, what a dream. Wow. I should make a drawing of the map. Okay. Alright. I don't think you could die in this game. That's the difference between this game and Maniac Mansion. But basically, he had a dream of aliens, and the machine he saw was like a vision. Somewhat, like it, it's a dream he had about aliens. All right, I'm gonna try to pick up the key, the card. Nope, pushed it way under the desk. All right. I'm picking up stuff ahead of time because I know I need them. Like sushi. Come with me, sushi. I think something's in here. Yep. What's this? Phone bill. Read phone bill. 1138. I better pay this soon. So the PC made a match which to the video go to the course demo tape thing. Yeah, yeah, I remember that. I remember that. Like when you play the the tentacles music, it's Zach's intro. All right, pick up the ball. Can you bend a knife and sell it to the guy at the pawn shop? Are you serious? I never sold a knife. Like I, I didn't bother. I actually got my money by uh, winning the lottery. Um. So I got that. I'm gonna pick up. I'm gonna open the the, the dresser drawer, desk drawer. I should say. Pick up. No, not the desk drawer. The controls are a little bit better than the Maniac Mansion one, but it's still kind of sluggish. But it's better. It's a lot better. Okay. I'm gonna get out of here. I'm gonna get the card. Don't worry. The loading might take a little bit more. could sell it to the guy. Oh wow, I didn't know that. All right, I'm gonna tidy up the place. Good idea, this place is a mess. Meanwhile, in the secret room. Emptiness, I should save. I should save often actually, in case it crashes. Hmm. I just talked to the king. He said that machine is. He said the machine is working perfectly. Yeah, working perfectly. 
He said it's just a few more days. All in a few more days, all Earthlings will be stupor stupider than we are. Yes, yeah, stupider than we are. I think you've been hanging around the machine too long. Yeah, too long. I think I need a new partner. Yeah, new partner. <laughs> that guy is freaking... See ya! It's so funny. Alright, so... I'm actually gonna plug the TV in. I think I have to use, yeah, it's a lot faster, the, the cord is a, I mean the, the cursor is a lot faster in this game than it is in Maniac Mansion. Okay, I need to find a remote, um, I remember it's behind this one, um, yeah, the alien's pretty funny, um, give me one second. I swear I get text while I'm streaming the most. All right, pick up the remote. It's a little bit hard to navigate this, but it's better using this controller, which is an Xbox One than, uh, back then we used an Atari and it was, then we noticed we could use Sega Genesis and then we switched, we start using the Sega Genesis Master System controller. But during the 80s, I think we had to use the Atari controller, Atari 2600. All right, so I'm gonna use the remote on the TV. Actually, let me just turn on the TV. I forgot. Oh my God, really? I wish I had a TV. Well, we do have a TV this size, but at, at its time, this TV is pretty huge. Not normal. Loading. I should save. I keep forgetting to save. Every time you see the snail, it's loading. Oh my god, I really gotta switch discs? Okay. <laughs> snail. Good morning, San Francisco. This is Lor Loria Amor. I think that's her last name. We'll continue with today's top story about the Yale Coed's mission to Mars. After this important message. Hello, I'm Anne Loris from the Society of, for Ancient Wisdom in San Francisco. Gosh, she looks very familiar. Where, where have I seen her before? Our quest for a greater understanding of the past can make a better world today. But we need help. Please deposit artifacts in our 14th Avenue drop slot. Yeah, I think it came out 87. I'm 100% sure. I promise they will be returned on damage. Thank you for your time. Now, from Mars, one of the women who made this dangerous journey, Melissa China. Hi there. Melissa, why have you and your friend Leslie traveled all the way to Mars? We had dreams in which an alien told us how to convert our van into a spaceship. We were told to fly to Mars and await further instructions. Yeah, you should. I mean, it costs a bit though, Commerce 64. So here we are. I see. And have you received your um instructions? No, we haven't talked to any intelligent being since we landed.
but we're willing to wait. Oops, my helmet says on my oxygen level is low. I have to go refuel it. Okay, Melissa, thank you and good luck. Oh yeah, you could die on Mars. <laughs> we'll continue with today's top story about the universal stupidity epidem epidemic. I said epidemic, I can't even speak. I'm getting tongue tied. After this, uh, after this, uh, after this story about the universal stupidity epidemic, so the machine is affecting her. The machine is affecting all aliens, actually. I mean, not aliens, humans. If you've been feeling increasingly stupid lately, you're not alone. Scientists are baffled by the mysterious buzz that is affecting people worldwide. The 60 cycle hum seems to come from every telephone line on the planet. A spokesperson for the phone company refused to comment. We we'll continue with today's top story about the universal stupidity epidemic. I think it's just gonna repeat now, so I'm gonna turn off the TV. After this, yeah, she's she's forgetting what she's saying, so she keeps saying the same thing over and over again. Okay. All right, I'm gonna open cabinet, pick up crayon box, close cabinet. Hmm, only one yellow crayon left. Okay, so I'm gonna use, cause he said he needs to jot down the map, if you remember him saying that in the beginning of the game. So I'm gonna use the yellow crayon on the torn wallpaper. Uh, did it work? Hang on. Actually, let me save. Let me save really quick because I don't want it to crash. Save. Oh, shoot. Okay, I'm going to call this Zach. Save. Zero one. Alright, I'm going to close the cabinet. I don't have to, but I don't know. Okay, let me try this again. Use yellow crayon on. Hello. Okay, now I gotta switch to side two. I drew the map of my dream. No, from my dream on it. Whoops. So if you read the, if you look at the map. It'll show you uh, like a diagram or something. Yeah, like all these space, all these uh, places. This is important. This is really important, actually. Yeah, it's just a habit. I don't know. Like I just close things. I hope this game doesn't crash on me, cause maybe I imagine crash on me twice. Okay, I got. Oh, I need a knife. It's right there. I need to get my card. That's crazy though that he <laughs> that the that the guy at the store thinks the bent knife is art. That's so dumb. <laughs> Abstract art. I, I swear, man. Like I'm doing CGI. I'm art. I'm technically an art student because I'm doing CGI. And some of this art is like, like really? It's called modern art. All right, I'm gonna use a butter knife. This is gonna be tough. On um, plastic card. Oh, I got it the first time. Yeah, I know, I know. No. 
Oops. No. Oops, I bent it. Okay. So now what I'm gonna do is uh I just have to collect items before I go to uh, the airport to head to Seattle. Um and I'm just picking up stuff. I mean it, it make it'll make sense later, but usually in graphic adventure games I just pick up everything first and then um anything that I could pick up I'll try to use. Sometimes you don't have to pick up everything, but I just pick up everything. There's a key. All right, I'm gonna open the door. Thankfully, in this game, you don't have to close your front door. Cause if it was a Sierra game, I could imagine. You will try to open the front door and you leave it open, someone will come in and rob your place. But luckily that doesn't happen in this game. So yeah, I'm just, right now I'm just um, getting stuff I, I know I need. Again, it's not necessary, but in this game, you do have to pay for airline tickets and it's best to just do everything where you're at before progressing anywhere else. So I'm doing as much as possible in this before I go to Seattle. So I'm gonna push the doorbell. Yeah, I, I like a lot of these. I like a lot of the characters in this game. We're closed, and we're out of fresh bread anyway. I can't do a French accent. I will do the voice acting better, but it's like I can't. I, I don't know how to voice act. We're closed. Uh. No, that's Italian. No, that doesn't sound like Italian. I don't even know what the accent that is. Listen, you don't want the bread we have left. Go away. I keep doing it. Okay, you ask for it. Oh, I didn't know that. That makes sense now. Pick up stale bread. All right. Show that freaking bread. Imagine eating that bread. You like break your mouth, and your like your whole, all your teeth will be broken, and your jaw will like unhinge. All right. I'm not going in a telephone, even though we do have to pay. Um, ticket I'm not gonna do it yet not the ticket the, the phone bill I'm gonna read my credit card really quick because it's always good to read the credit card to see what what limit you have it was so pen otherwise I saw you went online I was just waiting for you to say something Zachary McCracken look at well I'm not gonna say anything yeah he has a he has a name of my one of my cousins Which is pretty interesting. I didn't. I, now I just figured that out. Well, his name was Zach, but I didn't know his full name was Zachary. But yeah, one of my cousins is named Zachary. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Hang on, let me see what happened. This guy taught. This guy. Why he timed you out? Stop spamming phrases. Yo, my bad. That was Nightbot. That was Nightbot, by the way. That was not... That was not... Uh, he freaking timed him out for saying close call two times. Hang on, let me fix that. Let me fix that. One second. Nightbot, what the hell are you doing, man? He's like, nope, you said close call too much. Like, two times. That's too much. Give me one second. <laughs> Nightbot, like... He's like, nah, man, you're spamming. Give me one second. Sorry about that. Okay, option repetitive I put the limit 20 times oh I, I guess I'll I raise it to 50 yo Nightbot is like 
playing no games. He said he's like two times no more. Freak it. All right. Sorry about that. <laughs> I thought I was like, yo, who banned? Who timed you out for five seconds? Jesus Christ. All right. I'm not gonna go in here yet. Well, I couldn't. I could. I couldn't. I'm gonna try what you said. Two phrases. No, that's it. You're like. You're repeating too much. Two phrases, that's it. Rip. He doesn't want you to say it two times. He wants to say it only once. That's it. I raise it to 50 to see if that helps. Hey, yeah, buddy. All right, let's see Let's see if I, if I could sell. Do I need a knife? I don't think so. Let me save it. Sorry, I burped. Let me save it, let me save it. Yes. <laughs> I'm gonna sell the bent knife. You gotta go to the sell window. Oh, oops. Is this the sell window? No, that's the buy window. Okay. Let me sell this. I'd like to sell this to you. Hmm. Oh, wow. What a beautiful silver sculpture. I'm adding this to my art collection. Are you serious? Oh my God. Wow. Give me your cash card. Here. Thanks. How much you gave me for it? Here's 15, 1500 bucks for it? A pleasure doing business for you? Are you serious? I'm gonna try that in real life. I'm gonna bend my knives and give and try to sell it as art. Maybe it'll work. Maybe I'll make like so much money. I'll say I'll sell ten of them so I could get like fifteen grand. Imagine. What? <laughs> oh my god. I've never done that before. Never. Like at all. Okay. I don't think I could do anything here. You know what? I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go to no. There, it might. This guy. I'm gonna go in off topic a little bit, but this guy wanted Snapchats. I kid you not, Snapchats of people on on Snapchat. And he's like, send me Snapchat, like send me nudes or whatever. And all he did was he, um, hang on one second. So to wake this guy up, like if you try to open this door, watch. Open bus. I'll tell the story in a bit. The door won't open from the outside, Jarvis is asleep. Okay, so to wake up the driver, you have to use the kazoo. That's the only song I know. Hey, what are you, what are you doing? Wake me up. I guess you want to go to the airport. Well, climb aboard. If you take too long, he um, will leave. I mean, he will just go back to sleep. So in order to board the bus, to pay for the ride, you have to actually use a card, your cash card, which is a credit card. All right, let's go. Did I save before I left? Normally, I want to save every time before before I leave to a certain destination. But, um, so the guy he asked for to continue my story. The guy asked for Snapchat news, and all the guy did was put him up on a gallery and made so much money. I sold them, and he sold them. Koa discovered long mile face on Mars. All right. Want to buy a book to, of enlightenment? Sure, I'll buy a book of enlightenment. The f the funny thing is, no, 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 no. Give the cat. Oh my God! Come on. 
I want to know how this devotee has like does he have a cash read like a card reader on him or something? That'll be forty two dollars. May you have may you find true enlightenment. There's a reason why I brought that book. You always need like again, I'm doing stuff way be I know that I need to do it ahead of time. Pass me the coins for it. No man, he's in he's enlightened. He's one of those, you know the dudes that have flowers and he, they have robes, right? And they approach you with like flowers and try to sell you like books. That's what he is. He's not a cannibal. You're late. I'll show you to your seat. <laughs> oh my god. Here it is. Ladies and gentlemen, you've heard this speech before, so I'll cut it short. In the likely event of a water landing, your cushion, your sea cushion may be used as a flotation device. If we lose ca cabin control, oxygen, cabin pressure, I should say, oxygen mass should appear, but don't count on it. Damn. Enjoy your flight. I have, I've have a feeling I won't. Such a negative Nancy. Okay. So I feel bad for the stewardess because I'm gonna make her flight a living hell. Let me save actually before I do this. Here's your meal. Right, let me save really quick. The reason why I'm saving is so that, because you have a time, a time limit. So I'm gonna go here. Here's your meal. Here's your meal. I'm gonna open this door. Here's your meal. Close door. Hello. Hello. I'm gonna use. Don't do this on the airplanes, okay? Do not do this on airplanes. Don't be an a hole. Okay, it's all clogged up. And I'm gonna turn on the f sink. Do not do this. Right, again, don't do this. Don't be an a hole. Don't do this, man. You probably get thrown off the airplane. So I'm gonna open the door and I'm gonna push the service uh, button. I'm gonna, I'm gonna jet out of here. <laughs> Don't be an a-hole, man. Do not be an a-hole. All right, I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna wait. Oh no, what a mess! Hmm. Sabotage sinks stiff stiffless searches stewardess. Do not do this, please. Again, don't do this. I'm gonna use the egg in the microwave, right? Close the microwave. Don't do this. And I'm gonna turn on the microwave. Don't do this. Do not do this. <laughs> Let me pause. Hang on. Let me read. I heard they won't. They won't beat you up anymore on those flights. If you go on United, yeah, they probably will beat you. What am I doing? Whoops. Sorry about that. What was that? What's that awful smell? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> ah, who did this? Oh my god, don't don't do this. Do not do this. Don't be opening other people's uh whatchamacallit? Compartments too. Oh what a mess! 
I, I'm telling you right now, do not do this when you're flying on the airplane. Unless you want to get kicked off, yeah, fly, do that. What a mess. Okay. Found it. Pick up oxygen tank. Again, I'm doing this because I know I need them. And I'm going to sit. I'm gonna, I, I, I didn't do anything. What a mess. Let me save. <laughs> I feel so sorry for her. Alright, I'm going to pause it. And I'm going to save. Do not... Don't be stuffing sinks, right? With toilet paper. Don't be putting micro like eggs in microwaves and heating it up on airplanes or in your house good thing this isn't a short stream because <laughs> i swear to god they see this in the game the little kid gonna be like oh uh, let me do this to mommy let me see if she gets mad what a mess poor stewardess man i feel so bad for her but say you didn't do those things if you try to open a compartment she'll put you in your seat she'll say what are you doing and then she'll put you in your seat so you had to do those things so you could delay her or distract her i should say so that you were able to pick up the cushion the, the lighter the an oxygen tank and I, i've done all that for a reason again i've done all that for a reason <laughs> now she's poor stewardess is gonna close all of the compartments now. She was right saying that she's not going to enjoy this flight. I think that's it. I could read stuff. I'll read a book. It's how to raise your consciousness and lower your golf scores. It's written by a guru in Nepal named Swami Holand Holandwanda. I'll read it later. All right, let's read our cash card to see how much cash we have now. Zachary McCracken balance is thirteen seventy. Oh shoot! I messed up. I'm not really. I did not mess up. I did not mess up. But um I could have brought something that I needed. But it kinda slipped my mind. But I, I could I could um use another another object. I just remember. That fifteen hundred for the bent spoon actually gave me a lot of money yeah, this game is excellent between Maniac Mansion and Zach McCracken I don't know which one is better both of them are really good obviously this game came out a little after uh, Maniac Mansion because you can tell by the graphics the cursor moves uh, slightly faster I think in my opinion um, it's it's made by the same people, so it's really good. You'll know it's gonna be good if it's made by the same people. If you enjoy one game by uh, companies, you'll most likely enjoy majority of their games. All right, so I'm just waiting. I, I had actually had a lot of time. So we're just waiting right now to make it to Seattle from uh, San Francisco I believe um, if you didn't have this game is cracked even on the Commodore 64 like usually the ones that I the one I, the version I have on the Commodore 64 is already cracked but um, the official game brings like a manual and you have to actually insert a code that's in the manual so you can purchase tickets but it's cracked so the version I have is cracked so that I don't have to do that because back then in, the, in uh, around this time there was a lot of pirating so they had to protect the, uh, their games from pirating 
granted they just hacked the game and they cracked it so that it's like you don't even need it you don't need the manual this game is actually worth a lot of money if I try to get an uh, cause I do want to get an original copy of this I do have it for the Commodore 64 but I don't think it's the original copy and when I try to look for it it's it's um, it's worth a lot of money Maniac Mansion is worth a lot of money too a lot of money so right now I'm just waiting I'm waiting for me for my Zach to make it to um, what you might call it to Seattle I mean I could walk uh, I, I, there's, nothing, there's nothing for me to explore anymore because I already went to the bathroom I already went to uh, the uh, oh let me show you something it's pretty funny Uh, it's a little bit different in this, in this uh, emulator. If I hit escape, it, it might close the whole the whole game, the whole. Um. So I'm gonna try to use a toilet. This is funny. Excuse me. Thank you. <laughs> I wanted to show that. All right, let's close the door. Wow, this is one long flight. Holy smokes! Again, it's not necessary to close the door, but I'm polite. I'm a polite person. In game and out, kind of. All right, so I'm, right, right now I'm just waiting. There you go. When you hear that sound, you're landing. <laughs> we are now landing. Prepare to disembark. <laughs> What's up, Gargan 100? <laughs> oh man, that emo. It's great, right? Let's sit down. It's been a joy having you on board. Have a nice day. She probably knew I freaking messed up the bathroom. Obviously, she did because I was the only one standing up. And I mess up the uh, microwave. <laughs> All right, so now we're in Seattle, right? Meanwhile, back in the secret room, I think we're in Seattle. Oh baby, I'm a jailhound dog. Let me meet tenderizing rocker in my blue suede. I know he's singing an Elvis song, but I, I can't. I don't even. I have not listened to the song. And what do you think you're doing? Grooving to the king. Stop it this instant. You're supposed to be watching the machine, not dancing like a gloom. Sorry. There is still a chance. Wow. A very small chance. I said that was so weird. That someone will discover the and activate the Scholarian device. It's the only thing that could stop us. Of course, we will soon be in control and won't have to worry. And the train decides to come. Thank you, train. But until then, keep your mind on the job. I'm not gonna scream because I'll, I'll get yelled at. Whatever you say, boss. See ya. Don't be cool to my heartache. I will just trend my lights because I'm all shaken up. I know he's singing an Elvis song, but I. Can't. I, again, I have not heard of that song. So I'm gonna read the newspaper. The newsstand. I think it's the same news. Koa discovered long face mile. Uh, mile long face on Mars. Yeah, it's the same. 
the funny thing is when you progress through the story you actually uh the tabloid changes okay so i kind of oh, did i got my peanut yeah i do okay so if i go here there's a two-headed squirrel let me think what would be a good headline How about two headed squirrel attack tabloid reporter? Maybe two headed squirrel devours Seattle and Tacoma. Vicious tabloid reporter turns two headed squirrel into monster. I hate my job. So the reason why he's here is because his boss told him to go to Seattle to s in in search of uh, UFO sightings. Well, to investigate the UFO sighting or interview people, I should say. And to interview, I mean, not to interview. Imagine interview the squirrel to look up the thing about the two-headed squirrel. So you can kill the poor little guy. Like if you, for example, okay, I'm going to pick up this branch I'm not gonna do it I am not gonna do it I actually like animals I don't want Peter to like get on me so you could use the stick on the squirrel and kill it but I'm not gonna do that I'm just gonna give the, the peanuts to the two-headed squirrel it took him a left if I try to go here nothing happens it's way too high. People can't see the emails unless they have Frank. Oh, they can't see the emails unless they have Frank or, Frank or Face Z. Uh, Panda the Wise has Frank or Face Z. I don't know if DH Comp. DH Comp, what are, you, what are you using? You're using your phone or your laptop or computer. I'm going to use the tree branch on loose dirt. Why? Because. Why not? The purpose of graphic adventure games is to explore. After lo after digging for a long time. Oh, you you're seen on your iPhone. Sheesh, that was a lot, a lot of work. So you don't you won't be able to see Frank or Faze Z emotes. I'm actually trying to make some Frank or Faze Z, uh, FFZ emotes. I'm just gonna say FFZ. Um, so I could have it on my channel I already put four of them so the only way you could see those emotes is by uh, having um, the the add-on okay so again it's pitch black I could do this okay since this is an abandoned you know what let me just take this I could do this though this is pretty, but the problem with using your lighter is it gets too hot and then it'll turn off. He'll it'll burn his hand and he'll turn it off. So I know there's a burn nest around here, so I'm gonna use the branch to get it. Cause if I try to get it regularly, it's too high. Okay, got it. So now I'm gonna use. Okay, there's a fire pit. I'm gonna use the burn nest on the fire pit. Thank you for the host, Gargan. Now I need it to, what he said? Appreciate the host. Um, so there's two ways to light this fire pit. I'm doing it the faster way. I'll tell you the other way way later. I don't want to spoil anything. I'm not going to say anything that happens in this game because I want to, um, what you call it. And thank you for the host, Pen of the Wise. I'm not going to mention anything in the future of the game because I want it to be a surprise for you guys. So, because if I say this, this, this happens, then it's going to spoil the, the surprise of the game, you know? Because it's like watching a movie. And you want to you wanna see it for yourself. So, I'm not going to speak much of what happens in the game.
right, so I'm gonna use a lighter on the fire pit because I need to see. And there we go. Actually, I am also gonna throw the tree branch in there. I don't need it anymore, so I'm gonna do that. Okay. That just helps fuel the fire. Um, there's a strange mark in here, but if you look at it, it's yellow. So, I'm going to use the yellow crayon on the marking, on the marking, on the marking. Hello, with yellow crayon. Connect the dot, la 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 la. And that happened. I match your host with the host. Okay, so if I try to pick this up, it's locked in place. But if you notice, if you look at the little uh, thing I'm using right here, the pedestal, look at the sensor. It's a sensor, right? So I'm going to use the remote control. Actually, I think I just used the remote control. Use remote control. And it unlocked. I guess I chose the right channel. I guess so. And now I'm gonna pick this blue crystal. This looks like an artifact. You went skateboarding to the park. Yeah, I'm, I, man, I remember when I used to skateboard. I just stopped. Okay, so I'm gonna save it. Because I want, I want to um, see what the crystal does, right? I'm gonna replace it. I'm gonna unpause, and now I'm gonna use. I just want to see what this crystal does. So there's a two-headed squirrel. I'm gonna use the crystal on two-headed squirrel. Oh, I feel dizzy. So, now, this happens. We're not sure what it does. We just know that um, we there's something with the squirrel. All right. What happened? I'm actually going to hide. Oh shoot. At that very moment, at that very instant in the secret room. <laughs> you busted your, your butt? You need to get good, man. What happened? A part of the device has been te discovered and tested. We must recover the artifact at once. Yes, at once. Wait! Your disguise. My disguise? Oh, I almost forgot. My hat and my nose glasses. How do I look? Ugly. Just like a human. Damn, yo, savage. Good. What a savage, yo. Say I'm ugly. Say human beings are ugly. All right. He's gonna come to my location. So, I'm actually just gonna go in here and hide. Because every time you use a crystal, they try to get you. If they catch you, it's not game over, but it's a pain in the butt.
Zorfrik? Zorf I missed I missed him. How does he know my How does he know my gender? Is he assuming my gender? I'm getting, tri I'm getting triggered. Okay. So we we just found out that the blue crystal did nothing with the squirrel. We don't know still what the blue crystal does. The funny thing is that the vice they're actually talking about, the um damn, I forgot the name of it already. But the device that they were talking about that could stop them, I actually include that device in my thesis. I made a 3D render of it and I put it as the device that um, the purple tentacle from the other tentacle uses to try to take over the world, which is pretty funny. All right, so we're done in Seattle. We went to Seattle, can't do, all you could do is just go in there. But we, we got the crystal, so we're gonna use this and we're gonna fly back to San um, Francisco because if you remember the um, I think her name is Annie or Anne Anne from um, from San Francisco wants she said if you find any artifacts to deposit to deposit the artifact in her not in her, oops, in the slot of her door. <laughs> oh my god. It, in the slot on her door. Not, not to deposit it in her. <laughs> not to deposit it in her. Okay, so we got our ticket. I think we got our ticket. Uh, use. I think I need to. Oh, I need to pick it up. Right? This game is... Did I pick up my ticket? Okay, I did, I did. Alright, so let's go. Let's go back to San Francisco. An enjoyable flight later. Thankfully, we don't have to experience a flight anymore. All right. Freaking um deposit the artifact in her like on the her door has a slot, you deposit the artifact in the slot. You didn't deposit the artifact in her. It kind of came out wrong. It came out really wrong actually. I'm glad I uh, changed my freaking streaming to mature because that would have got me flagged for being uh, for using vulgar language. Actually, if you read the door, it also says it. There's nothing to read. What is this right here? Are you telling me? Okay, I actually had to read the sign. Whoops. Society for Ancient Wisdom. Deposit artifact in slot. There you go. You're bound to bounce. <laughs> Alright, so I'm gonna insert the crystal in this slot. I'm gonna drop the crystal in the slot. Hey you! Where do you get that artifact? Never mind that. You're the woman who was in my dream. What a line. Wait a second, I had a dream too. I was in a strange room with a strange man. It was you. Come with me. Will that work in your life? I say, yo, you're my, you're the girl in my dream. Will she take me to her place? Maybe I should say.
My two friends and I have had special dreams sent to us by the ancient ones, Illuminati. You're the one they told us about. Give me a break. I see you're skeptical. You'll soon change your mind. In my dream we shared in the, in the dream we shared we saw a strange device which we must build. Here's a drawing of it. Hey, that's it. The blue crystal you brought me is a part of this device. This is another part of it. Here, when you're one hole, the crystal shard will let you join my friends on Mars. Of course, you'll need a spacesuit. A spacesuit? Oh yes, here's your artifact back. For now on, we will all share knowledge through our dream. Be careful, if one of us dies, it will be impossible to complete our mission. Oh yeah, you could die in this game. Switch, 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 the Nintendo Switch, switch, switch. All right, I'm gonna save it. I know, I know, oh my God, this guy's saving a lot. But I need to save. Like she said, if one of us dies, that's it, it's dead end. That end city. Okay, so I'm gonna switch to Anne. So we need to find the other piece, Annie. Annie, are you okay? Are you okay? Are you okay, Annie? All right, I'm not gonna sing anymore because I don't want you in trouble. All right, so I'm gonna pull. There you go. That's her card. Pick up. Card cash. You gotta be really careful with her in particular because she doesn't, she does not have that much money. Watch, if I read it, she only has five thousand four hundred and five dollars. So we could switch to, if you saw, we could switch to uh, Melissa and Leslie. Um. Who do I wanna? I could switch to Melissa and Leslie, but let's play with Zach. Oh shoot! Let me save actually. Again, I'm gonna save again. I know. I'm gonna switch to Melissa, just so you could see the, uh, so you could see what it is. If you remember Melissa's in Mars. Side one. Yes, I'm using a uh, emulator because again, it's a lot easier to play the game and stream on on Twitch using rather than using a capturing card that might not work with uh Commodore 64 is easier on this. The landing site on Mars. Next time you call me Neon Venom, I'm going to purge you, okay? It's Neo Venom, not Neon Venom, okay? And I'm not putting some requests. I'm getting a little tired of waiting here for instructions. Yeah, this place is boring. It's got a great beach, but no water. I know guys. We should have gone to Fount Lord. Oh my god, I didn't even read it. Oh shoot. It would have taken us two days in instead of two months. And I wouldn't have gotten sick every time I look out the window.
Yeah, and zero gravity, that sure was a mess. Okay, so I'm gonna do this quick because they do have oxygen. I'm going to control Melissa. Actually, I have to go in here. Open the door. Let me actually uh, save because I could die here. If I mess up, I could die. So, let me save it. I know I just saved before, but I want to save again. I'm actually, in order to refuel your oxygen, you have to use uh, this. Hang on, let me, let me recheck. Win the lottery or stack first, then repeatedly sell something expensive to Zach. And then give the money to Melissa while buying that expensive item again. Oh, okay. I learned the strategy in the walkthrough, bro. Game facts. I used to use that in so many games back then. Alright. I'm doing this because um, I want to. I need oxygen. It's, if you. Okay, I have to pull this out actually. Um, pick up cash cards. Can you pick up the boombox? I don't think so. Now I'm going to switch to Leslie and do the same thing. And Katie. <laughs> Usually what I do is I buy the expensive tickets on Zach and I just give it to Melissa. I mean, Annie. Because, um... Whatchamacallit. He has a lot of money, right? So I just do that. The only thing is she needs a she needs a ticket back. Now my oxygen is full. Okay, she's full too. Actually, I'm gonna have her wait inside. Let me save again because I, again I do not want to die. You could die if you mess this up. Um, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna close the door. that um, depressurize, well, fill the van with oxygen, and now I could take off her helmet. Okay, let me use the boom box. Wait, wait, use radio. Turn on radio. Ooh, wait one second, let me put on the helmet again. Okay, let me open the door. Actually, I'm supposed to do it with Leslie. Um, yeah, Leslie. I want I want you to guys to hear the music. So, let me switch to Melissa. Yeah, where? Wait, hang on. Read cash card. Oh, let's switch to side two. Melissa China. Okay, so this is her cash card. I'm gonna give this to Leslie because that's hers. I know that's hers. I'm trying to find the tape. Where's the tape? Oh, there it is. Okay, I'm going. I'm gonna go here. Oh, close the door. Actually, let me. Okay, I'm gonna close the door. And I'm going to take off my helmet. And I'm gonna switch. If you open the door with the other person, while the person is in there with the helmet off, they die. So don't do it. All right, I'm gonna go in here. So the first time I played this game, I was like, where the, I gotta switch actually. So the first time I played this game, I had to actually, um do a lot of backtracking because I didn't know what to do. Well, I saw my brother play, so I kind of had a, like a mini guide to what to do. Because I again, at the time I played this game, I was what? 
six, seven. All right. So, shoot. I you see, I keep forgetting something again. Ah oh, man, this is this is this is. Uh, I keep forgetting. All right. <laughs> I gotta switch to Melissa. You could actually leave Mars. If you go in there and you start the engine, you could actually leave Mars. But if you do that, you kind of dead end the game. So let's put on her helmet because her helmet is off. Open the door. Because I need this fuse. I need a fuse. Okay, I'm gonna switch to Leslie. There's also a random store in the city where you can reside. I have it. Have what? What are you talking about? A sign for collector. Wait, hang on. Let me read. Sorry. Aside from collector cards and games, where can I buy physical Commodore 64? Um, there's a shop in Jersey that has uh every single console, well, almost every single. I think they have every single console. They actually sell Commodore 64s there. Um. Collect the cards and games is really good because I actually brought in television from there. Um, if usually what you want to do before ordering there is you want to, um, you want to email him to see if he has it in stock. If he has it in stock, um, then you don't have to worry about uh, um, ordering something and having it not be in stock. Can I stream Overwatch? No. I'm not streaming Overwatch. Let me close the door. The shop is called... Yeah, Digital Press. He said it. He's unreliable? That's weird. Because when I... When I ordered my things way back then, he... He um, was responsive. Like, he was really responsive, actually. Maybe he doesn't have the shop anymore? I don't know. I know he used to live in Jersey. Then he moved to Florida. But I haven't ordered there in, like, a long time. Okay. So, if I try to push this button... Let me actually read this sign before I push the button. Don't be a space goof. Always wear your space helmet. So... A reminder from friendly ho uh, hostel. So if I try to push this button, it doesn't work. There is panels here, right? But when I first played the game, I was trying to find a, a screwdriver, but I couldn't. I think it's this one. Uh, open. screwed in I think you use the uh, use card on screw hmm don't if I, if I can't figure out something don't say anything I want to figure it out myself it's been a while since I played this game I wanna I want to figure it out myself I believe there's there's a if I remember correctly, before I do that, let me do something. Let me actually put her helmet back on. There is stuff that is good in NJ. Damn. It's got a lot of video games. To PS, PS6. PS6 is in this, man. I'm put on my helmet again. Okay. Let me switch to Leslie. I think I could open the side doors. What is Digital Press? Digital Press is a store. I wanted to show you it. Open shipper door. No, this is why I did that. This is specifically why I did that. Uh, I 
I can't open the side door. Open. Shut all the bug. I think I could uh I could use something. Pick up cassette. All right. Actually, let me let, let me put it in the cassette tape so you can hear it. Can I pick this up? Pick up boombox. Okay, yeah, I could. Okay, so I don't have to play it there. All right, let's go with uh, Melissa. Oh shoot, did I mess it up? The the dead below. Heard of it actually. Reese's album from Maniac. Yep. I wanted to actually uh <laughs> I gotta remember. I ha I, I think I rem There's something I need. Pick up? Can I pick up the sign? No. There's something I need to open the panel. But I'm gonna I'm gonna first Oh I know what I know what I know what I know what. Ransom is not in this game, unfortunately. I know what. Okay, I know how. I remember. Shh. Hey, hey. No hints. I'm gonna try to remember it. No hints. I, I, I do remember now. No hint. I wanna figure it out myself. Switch to side two. Ransom. Ransom is not in this game. He's not in this game. Okay, so let me read her. 342. Who has the most money? 342. Out of the, let me just read this in case so I'm, they're not dying. Oh my god. Seriously? Just to read the helmet, I had to switch sides? 54 minutes. Okay, that's enough time. Let me switch to my. She has what? 342? Okay, I'm gonna check how much she has. Use. I mean, read. Cash card. She is loaded. She has 1,138. Okay. So if I read this. Face area rapid transit. $100 for each token. So she's loaded. I'm going to use the cash card on this thing. Okay. A token. He see Ransom comes later, he's being helpful for Ransom. Place in the twenty first century. I actually don't know what time period that takes place. I'm gonna save uh, one more time. Cause again, I could die in Mars. I don't wanna die. Okay, now that I have the token. Um, let me go in here. So with the token, I tried the tape. It didn't wanna work on the bolts. I tried the credit card. It did not wanna work on the bolts. However, if I use a token on the metal plate, I open it. The fuse, it looks like a fuse box. So I'm gonna switch to um, Leslie. Then the ransom is a little older. They actually, I don't think they mentioned what 
time period that this game takes place. You always want to be careful because you don't want to leave one of these peop uh, girls out because she, they could run out of oxygen. So the best thing to do is put them somewhere, right? And have them take off their helmet. That it's safe to take off their helmet. So I'm going to use the fuse in the burnt fuse. Okay, she just took it off. So I'm going to use a new fuse in the fuse box. No. Use fuse in fuse box. That ought to fix it. All right. Now we could use this button. Again, you have to be really careful here. If you if you're not careful, you could kill someone. So now I'm going to push this door. I mean this button, I should say. And that sound means that it's getting filled with oxygen. And now we get to see how they look. Because remember, you couldn't even see them. So I'm going to take off her helmet. We got some, uh, you know, girl with blue hair. And now we're going to switch to Melissa. And we're going to take off her helmet. Again, these are the chords that went to, um, and there's Melissa. So we're going to be Melissa for now. The two girls that went to Mars. There's a tape there. I'm going to look underneath these covers. Pull covers. I don't know what's underneath the covers. Pull the freaking covers. I'd rather not find out. I guess it won't hurt to look. Oh, it's a broom. It's just a broom. No way it has eyes. It's a dead alien. Ah, she's actually running by herself. I'm not I'm not even controlling her. She's running by herself. Like she she ran completely to the door. Oh man, it's pretty funny. Did it crash? Please tell me it did not crash. It crashed. Oh my god. Damn it. Load it up again. Oh shoot, it really crashed it. I gotta re I gotta hard reset it. Oh crap. I gotta close it completely. <laughs> oh no! This is oh my god! This is so bad. I gotta actually. Oh man! Oh, man. I gotta close it through Task Manager. Seems good. <laughs> I'm gonna launch it again. <laughs> now I don't no. I don't have to restart the computer. It freaking crashed. Let me load it. This is why I saved. Oh, I gotta do all that crap again. <laughs> oh that's great. <laughs> it was up and hate. And hit, right? That's how you pronounce it. Freaking game crashed on me. I blame Gargan. It's Gargan's fault that the game crashed. Crumble and dust it away. Okay, so I'm gonna switch to the Melissa again. No, not Melissa. Switch to Leslie. <laughs> it crashes. Man, it crashed. That's so bad. That happened to the other game too. It crashed randomly. <laughs> what 
Oh, c'est qui, quoi? Let me save. Let me save. Let me save. Let me save. Hey, be nice to the guest, okay? If you're not nice to the guest, I'm gonna have to purge you. Okay? I'll purge your mod. Just saying. Be nice. No, he's not a mod. You guys are mod. You're supposed to represent the goodness in people because you're mods. All right? You want to get <laughs> Yo, relax. Relax, relax. It will be my pleasure. Oh my god. All right, I'm gonna push this again. I swear, if it crashes again, I'm gonna. I don't know what I'm gonna do. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna take off the helmet. Wish I could see the scene. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna switch to Melissa. I said to be nice to the guest, you know. Be nice to the guest. <laughs> Take off helmet. You're distracting me from the game. You see what happens? All right, I'm gonna save it again. Cause I swear, if it crashes, I don't know. Let me save. All right. Let's go through the door. Hopefully it won't crash. I'm pull the covers. I don't know what's on enough covers. Pull covers. And I'd rather not find out. Can you just pull the covers? I guess it wouldn't hurt to look. Oh, it's just a broom. No, wait, it has eyes. It's a dead alien. All right, I'm not gonna put her outside. She's not even gonna go in the room. I mean, she's gonna stay here, but I'm gonna switch. I swear if this crashes, I'm gonna be pissed. You know what, let me save once again. It's not a good start. It crashed like right away too. Okay, I'm gonna switch to Leslie. She's so freaked out that to the extent that she crashed, she can't, she can't. I know you saw the part, cause it crashed. Okay, so Leslie, if she looks at the, I mean, she can't look at the broom. She's gonna pick up the broom. Well, I just pretend there's a broom. So she just picked it up, she's not scared. Um, I'm gonna pick up the ladder, cause I need it. Um, I'm going to pick up the vinyl tape, and I'm gonna open the locker. Pick up this flashlight. The reason why I'm doing everything with Leslie is because she has the broom, and I actually could use the broom. I'm gonna use. I'm gonna. I'm gonna open this one. So the funny thing is, you see that gas canister right here? I'm gonna move Leslie. I mean M Melissa. That gas canister. If I try to pick it up, I don't need it. It's for a different game. So the gas canister that it's in that you need for Maniac Mansion is actually in Zack McCracken, which is pretty funny. Maniac Mansion, remember, Maniac Mansion was the game that was made first. This game was made after. So, I'm gonna switch to Leslie. She has the broom because she's a woman? No! No, 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 no. She doesn't have the broom because she's a woman. She has the broom because she's brave enough to take the alien. It's an alien, it's a dead alien, it's not a broom. 
So I'm gonna use the helmet. Yeah, put on helmet. Okay, I gotta put on the helmet. And I'm gonna push the the this. The reason why I'm pushing this is because I want the area to get locked in um, the room that Melissa's in. And now I'm gonna push this button. Cause again, if I kill one of them, it's game over. <laughs> Thor's hammer? I don't know about that. Oh my god, I forgot something. Here I go forgetting stuff. I always forget stuff. Alright, I'm gonna push this again. Because I forgot to get the ticket. It's really expensive too, so... Push button. I'm doing that because, again, to fill the, whatever this thing is, with, with, um, hair. I was about to say with hair. Her, okay, the funny thing is with Leslie, every time you take off her helmet, the color of her hair changes. Alright, so let me switch to Melissa. I mean, Melissa. Uh, not Leslie. The only reason why I know a lot about this game is because I've played it a lot of times. Like, how, how, like 15 times maybe? 10 times? Okay, I'm gonna... I keep switching to the wrong person. I'm gonna give the token to... Um, Leslie. Here's one token. I might have to get another token. I'm going to switch to Leslie now. I don't know, like, for me, I can't play the PC version. It's too, like, um, different. Well, not, it's not different, it's just, I'm so used to the Commodore 64 version that I don't want to use another version. Granted, people say, you know, this one is the most dated one, but it's whatever. So... A very important thing is that, and I know this because I've played the game, to buy two tokens, buy two tokens before you take the tram, the, yeah, the tram. And there's a reason why. I'm not going to say why, but there's a reason why. So I'm going to use cash card in here. No. In monolith. And she has another token. So he has two tokens. If I try to take this now, actually, let me save it before I do that. Because I don't want it to eat my token. And it might crash. It might crash again, you never know. So if I try to take the, the, the tram, right? I'm going to use a token on the tram. You see how it doesn't want to work? If I go in a tram, use tram with token. Oh my god, come on. Use token and tram. It just spits out the token again. So it's not working. There's a reason why it's not working. Um, let me just read her he helmet really quick because I don't want her to run out of oxygen. Oh my god, come on. No, 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 no. Read it. 
read home man. 50 minutes that should be fun. and you know what I'm gonna fill it up again they're on Mars by the way if anyone wants to know where they're from I mean not what know where they're from where they are I should say so I'm going to use the oxygen valve because I want her to be full of oxygen mm -hmm. I know it's a little redundant I'm doing things over and over again but it's necessary there's a lot of backtracking in graphic adventure games so now her helmet is full So you see this pile of sand, right? You see how you could kind of see like something gray here? So since she has the broom alien, I'm gonna use the broom alien on the sand. After sweeping for some time. I know, right? She doesn't, ta-da, gee, it looks like a solar panel. So. All she has to do to change her hair color is, yeah, she just puts on the helmet. Imagine you could do that, like in real life. You just put on something and your hair changes. Okay, so now that's there. That's exposed. The code. Uh... When the time is right, yeah, I use it. You could actually put both of them in here. Tram is leaving for 10 seconds, but I don't have to put both of them in here. Tram is leaving in five seconds, all aboard. They do this so you could board both characters on here, or as many characters. Here we are. We're at another section. The pyramid on Mars. So remember how I told you to get two tickets? This is why. If you look at this, it's all broken and it's out of order. So if you don't have a ticket, I mean not a ticket, if you don't have a token, you are stuck here. I mean you could call it back. No, I don't think you could call it back. Maybe you can. I haven't tried it. So now I'm going to use, there's another pile of sand and there's a door here. So I'm going to use the broom on the sand again. After sweeping for some time. Achoo! Kazoo type. You're alive! Ah! Ah! Choo! I try to take a nice peaceful nap and what happens? An inconsiderate alien and an ugly one at that sweeps up sand with my head. I'm sorry. The nerve of some beans. <laughs> I'll go find another planet where I could get somewhere else. So he wasn't dead. He was just sleeping all the time, like the whole time he was sleeping. So there's, I did that for a reason. You saw a key, a keyhole, but I don't have a key. So right now I'm going to go, I'm going to use the token with the tram again. Okay, that didn't work. And I'm going to go back to um, the place I was at. I'm in 15 seconds. Time is 10 seconds. Time is leaving 5 seconds. All aboard.
So now she's going back. I'm gonna actually put her with Melissa. And then I'm gonna switch to uh, the other characters. I'm gonna switch to Zach. This game is really good. I like this game. This game is a lot harder than uh, Maniac Mansion. A lot harder. Because in Maniac Mansion, you only have one place, and that's the mansion. This one, you have Mars. You have a whole bunch of places to go to. And there's a there's a, like a money limit, so you have to be careful. Because you could dead end the game. If you run out of money, you're stuck in that place. So, I'm going to... Again, push the switch, the outside door one, first. And then I'm gonna push this one. So what was what was the color of her hair before? Red, right? It was blue and now it's, it was red. Let's see what's her hair now. Take off her helmet. Let's see what color it is now. It's yellow. I kind of like that, that she changes her colors. Okay, so now they're done. I don't have to do anything else with them. What I could do is I could play the music. Um, that's in the boom box, the cassette, I should say. Use cassette and boom box, just so you could hear it. Turn on boombox. Play. Wow. Dankin' Dankin Darken Tunes. Razor's a Oh my god, I didn't see. She blows poodles over old Zorg whatever. So this song that's playing right now is made by Razor from Maniac Mansion 1. Alright, I'm gonna switch to that. I like the music though. I mean, when I switch, it's gonna go away anyways. So now, I gotta switch to side 2. Side, uh, two. Please tell me did not crash. You heard that? Oh, hell no. <laughs> Okay, maybe I have to turn off the music. It crashed again. <laughs> That's not good. All right, let me do this again. Oh my God, I'm sorry, like repeating the same thing. Oh man, it crashed again. So maybe I should turn off the radio before going back to Zach. Okay, so the solar panel is fixed again. Damn, that's bad. It crashed twice. This is why I don't like freaking ROMs. ROMs crash. But my original copy is messed up. Like, if I try to go to um, Mars, there's like a 50-50 chance of it working and it crashing. On the, or the one I have for the Commodore 64. The original Commodore 64. You do know that the PS4 crashes, right? I'm just saying, it does crash. Just saying. And how you would you know if you don't own a, a PS4? So now I'm going to go back to here. All right. And now I'm going to use the broom again on the sand. I need to do this with Razor. I mean, not Razor. With, she looks like Razor. With, um... Leslie, again. Hello, use broom. 
Not on door. Oh my god. Use. Okay, there you go. Okay, sometimes sweeping. I'm gonna actually save once I go to. I think. Achoo, you're alive. Achoo. I'm not gonna read it because you already know what happens. Ah, right, whatever, I'll read it. Try to take a nice, na peaceful nap, and what happens? An inconsiderate alien with an, an ugly one like that sweeps up sand with my head. I'm sorry. The nerve of some beings. I'll go rest on another planet where I. I'll go find another planet where I crew. Get some rest. So hopefully it won't crash. Let's try this again. Because that's really uh unfortunate. Use tram with tokens. I'm actually going not even gonna play the music. <laughs> Cause if it's if that's causing the crash, I'm not gonna play the music. You already heard it. So I don't have to play it. I'm gonna save it before I switch characters and then try to switch to Zack. Time is leaving in five minutes. Five seconds. That's two crashes already. I mean, Maniac Mansion crashed twice too. I'm definitely not gonna finish this today. It's gonna be a while. I'll continue on Thursday, for sure. Man, that sucks. All right. Time to go back in here, back in here. That's twice it crashed when I was in the building. When she went right when uh, Melissa went out, it crashed. It crashes because this is not a uh, legit copy. When you transfer games into ROMs, there's a possibility that the transfer is not, or I should say, convert them. Um, it could mess up the game, the process. <laughs> Take off my helmet. Let's see what color her hair is. I think it should still be blonde, but we'll see. Yep, blonde. Okay, so I'm gonna save really quick. I'm gonna save because again, I don't want it to crash. I'm actually gonna save it as another file. I mean, you can't see the screen, thankfully, but you'll see. Yo, you don't even see that. Okay, that. Can you? No. That's pretty good. Or maybe you can. Sorry, my nose is itching. Alright. I'm gonna go in here. The good thing is when you're not using the helmet, it doesn't run out of oxygen. Alright. So, here I'm gonna switch. I'm not even gonna play the music, nothing. Yes. Okay. It worked. Well, they're on site too. It worked. That's good. That's really good. It must have been a. It must have been that I was playing the music, so it kind of like glitched. So now that we're here, I'm going to. I know Florida is a dead end. I know that for a fact, actually. I'm actually going to put Anne as well. Annie, I should say. Oh, Anne, Andy. I'm going to put her next to Zach, and they're going to travel together. Like in the airport, they're going to travel together. I know for Anne, I need her for a specific place. 
So I'm gonna use a kazoo. Wait, hang on. Let me switch to Annie. And then I'm going to go to where Zach is. And then once I wake up the bus driver, I'm going to actually um, board Annie and Zach on it. Yeah, I know I have to go to certain places with specific people. If not, they can, they're just not going to, um, I won't get much of the story. So, if you notice the sprite is not as, uh, it's not as outrageous as, um, outrageous as um, Maniac Mansion, even though I like the sprite of Maniac Mansion, simply not. Okay, use kazoo with, oh, just use kazoo. And you kind of cheat the double fare, you just per, you just pick with one person. And then they both will take the ride. So I'm gonna go here. I'm gonna switch to Annie. I'm gonna go on the bus. I'm gonna switch to Zach. I'm gonna use. Where is it? Oh my god. Yes, I know. One second. One second. Let me actually save again. Where's his cash card? I hey, do actually see the saving. Oh, actually, I can move about piles. Okay, since this time that okay, there it is. Use cash card in reader. You, yes, dude, man. I'm trying to do that, man. Relax. Oh, she has to pay too. I thought you yeah, was able to cheat the system. Okay, use the cash card. Reader. So you have to pay with both. I thought I only had to pay one. Okay, so she's here, and so is Zach. Let me look at this, use terminal. Okay, London, I know that Actually, I think I need to go to Miami, if I remember correctly. And then I'm gonna go back to... Okay, yes, 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 yes. Okay, I know, I know what to do. Because at certain places you can only fly, like at certain locations you fly to specific places. So I know what to do. Okay, I'm going to... Um, let me save again, just in case. I know I'm saving constantly, but again, I'm doing this because I don't want it to, to myself. Yeah, you could use different characters in um, this game. You could use four. In Maniac Mansion, you use three. Maniac Mansion was a game that came out before this one. Um, in certain games, you could switch characters. There was a game I played. Uh, called Timberweed Park and you were able to switch to four characters and in order to do certain things in the game you have to pick that character like you cannot do it with anyone else so they kind of force you to use th 
of multiple characters rather than just sticking to one character, which is pretty interesting. Like I, I like the idea of using multiple characters. Like think of it like, um, was it Arkham City that you play as Catwoman? How you can only access certain areas with Catwoman, not with Batman. It's kind of similar in the graphic adventure game. Well, in this one in particular, you need certain characters for certain situations, which is pretty, yeah, it's pretty cool. I, I like the idea. All right, so I'm gonna go, I saved it already, okay. Unfortunately, in this game, you could actually die. And when the character dies, that's it, it's game over. You have to actually start from scratch, which is a little bit harsh, but it kind of um, forces you to be aware of your decisions. Okay, so this guy is um, just wandering around. And there's what you do with him in particular, you know how he's in debt and everything, and he wants car, like he wants a, uh, money. I'm actually gonna give him the book. Because remember, it's a book of enlightenment. I heard of this guy, Guru, Guru. I heard of this Guru. Let me see what he has to say. Ah. 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 Yeah, one of the characters is named Zach. It's actually his game, Zach McCracken. I understand now. I don't need this whiskey anymore. No, any longer. Here, and thank you. So, he starts, this is pretty funny. He starts dancing like the, the guy. So I'm gonna save it. But yeah, the one of the, the character, the main character of the game, which is this guy, his name is Zach, Zach McCracken. And what he does, well, he was put in a situation where he had to go to a certain place, but before he went to that place, he had a dream of like a dream involving all the, no, not all the characters, the girl that, that you saw, he had a dream with that girl and that girl was in that and that girl had a dream of him and they had this dream of a machine. And then we find out that that machine could prevent the aliens that are trying to take over the world. Um, it will stop them from doing that. So we're on a mission to build this device and um, use it against the aliens. So right now, in the process right now, I'm just trying to get pieces of it. All right, so I'm gonna use this. I know that the music must be tiring. <laughs> you look like he's moonwalking. Yeah. He's probably, he's moonwalking, man. Michael Jackson got his moves from this game. Okay, you could actually press anything. And it'll still read, because it's cracked. If it was not cracked, I had to get, actually get a manual for this book. For the game, I should say. Okay. All right, so that's all we do in Florida because you basically go to Florida just to um, give the book to this guy. That's the only purpose. Cause look, I can't even get out of here. Freaking Florida, man, broken. If I, if I read this door, the sign. Miami closed for repairs. <laughs> Let's read the tabloid to see if anything changed. It might be the same thing. Two headed squirrel on ravenous rampage in Pacific Southwest. I mean Northwest. The reason why I went on a rampage is because we 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 opened the uh, cave where he was at. We made it bigger, so he ran out. The plane is not here yet, so we have to wait. I have to wait. I still have to wait. I just like the name. That's my opinion. If I had a kid, I'll name him. 
<laughs> Never use that name on him. <laughs> so I have to wait for the the plane. What the heck? Maybe if I switch to another character, let me save it. I'm gonna switch to another character and then switch back and maybe that will put the, pl the plane there. All right. I'm doing that just to see if time changes. Okay, now, now I'm gonna switch back to Zach. Maybe if you add add Marie to it. <laughs> okay, you see how it changed? The plane should be here. Oh my god. Do I have to wait a long time? Let's wait two minutes. It's 10.06 now. There's a game I'm gonna play. Cause you know, each graphic adventure game is different. There's a game I'm gonna play where you play as the a leader of a biker gang. That one is really interesting. That one is really good. And it's fully voice acted, so I don't have to read the dialogue. The plane is not here right now. What time the plane comes? Destination. I do want to go to the Bermuda Triangle. There's a reason why I want to go there. Ticket is refundable. No, I'm, I'm gonna. Oh man. Can I not? Let me switch again to see what happens. Not turn off. Switch. Let me just. I'm just doing this so that um, I could kill time. Like in game time. So like. And then I'm gonna switch back to Zach. I think it's when I see the plane there. Or like what looks like a plane that I could take it. So once I'm here, I'm gonna switch back again. And in later games, um, you don't have this huge command list. I mean, you do have it for some of them, but uh, like a lot of them, but majority of them use icons instead of text in the later games. Please tell me the plane is here. The plane is not here. Maybe I don't, you know what? Maybe it's too soon to go there. Um, man, it's such a waste. Three hundred and five dollars. I could go here. I'm trying to think. Mexico City. No, not there. Let's see if I buy it again. Let's see what happens. Maybe I could take it. Again, if I had if I had the non-crack version, I had to get a manual for it. Let's see. Is it here? If it's not here, then I'm gonna just switch. Yeah, it's not here. Okay. I'm going to go to. I actually wanted to go to. Oh, no, not Mexico. I could go here, but. Whoo! That's a lot of money. That's a lot of money. 
Uh, let me actually save before I do that. Just in case. All right. I'm gonna go to. Yeah, cause Mexico. I need something for Mexico. Again, it doesn't matter. I know in Egypt though you could die, which is a little, it's a little, you know, I don't want to die. You could die, actually. If you go into a certain place, you could die. I remember that. So before I do anything, I'm gonna, okay. So we're in Egypt. Cario? Carvo? Can't pronounce name. So we could go to two places. Let's go here first to see what's here. I'll let you know when I'm in the in the place what it, what happens. So this is open, which is really weird. I think I I think I'm too early here. Okay, so this is this is uh It's really dark. Where is it? Where is it? I'm looking for a torch. Actually, let me just use the uh, flashlight. Actually, let me save because, yeah, I don't want to die. Let me save. One second. Okay. I'm going to turn use the lighter as a light source. But again, I can't have it too... I can't have it too long. I can't have it on for too long because uh, it crashes. I mean, it'll get too hot. Oh my God, where's the torch? Uh, no, there's a doorway here. Oh hell no. Okay. You know what? I'm not, I'm coming back here later. I'm coming back here later. Let me actually turn this off. I know the Ah oh, man. I think I should I should not come here. I need a flashlight, not a lighter. You know what? I'm gonna load it up again. You know, sorry about this, but I'm gonna load it up again because I'm gonna buy stuff. Oh shoot. Oh well. I was supposed to, I should have brought a flashlight. I think there was a flashlight, but it's whatever, it's, it's okay. I think I messed up. This torches that you could light up. All right, DH comp. See you later. Thank you. I appreciate it. Oh, shoot, I went the wrong. I went to the wrong leg. I think it's this leg. Yep. See you again. Thanks for stopping by. Oh, I gotta switch.
So right now I'm just exploring. And it's funny I have to I have to switch sides to uh to um do this. Do I remember the design? Let's see. Oh shoot. I think I don't remember the design. You know what? I might have to pick other people. Oh uh, no, this not gonna work out. Okay. I'm going to switch. Um, I should have went to, I should have went somewhere else. I'm going to waste time. I'm going to waste money. Let me actually read the cash card. I got to switch to side too. In the later games, you don't have to switch sides. It's, it's more, okay. He has a lot. He has enough money. Um, Hang on, I gotta go to the airport. Cause I, I don't know the design of that. Like the design to paint. I do figure out later, but I need to see someone first. this please take me I know Nepal is something I can't remember what if this is a I should really go back to San Francisco oh my god it's gonna cost a lot actually let me go here I swear if, the, if, if it's a place that I'm not supposed to be at I'm just gonna reload it again Cause I'm wasting too much money, and I don't want to waste a lot of money. Cause if you if you waste all your money and you can't buy tickets, okay. So we're going to Finland, it seems. Try to remember what's this place. I, I, it's been a while since I played this game. I went the wrong way. Oh, shoot. Yikes, what was that? Oh my god. Okay, I'm not supposed to be here. I'm loading the back. I remember this place. Okay. Because <laughs> it's a lot of like money. Okay. We're not going there. We're not going to Nepal. Why she said Nepal? Actually, we could go to Nepal. Um, you know what? Let's go here. Oh my god, that's a lot of money. Let me save it. Let me save it. That's a lot of money. I am definitely not gonna finish this before 11 o'clock. It's gonna take a while. It might take two or three days. Okay, so we're at Nepal. Um, let's see. I know what to do. I know what to do. Don't be doing this, by the way. When you're in other countries, don't be doing this. So, <laughs> so we got 
this flag, right? <laughs> Let me save. Okay. Don't pick up the flag. Don't be doing this. Pick up flag pole. I don't know if I need that, but it's whatever. I think I do need that. Whoa, this is why you save because yeah. That's what happens when you try to steal stuff. This is Nep uh, Nepal. Like in this game, you have to travel around the world, like specific place to uh, to um, find, like to look for your pieces. I can't. I can't have access here because this guy's guarding, right? So, you see this haystack? I'm gonna use. Don't be doing this in real life. I'm gonna use a lighter. In. So, we did that, right? Do not do this. Don't go to other countries and set things on fire, you know? Because if you do that, it's going to be a problem. So yeah, I just set a freaking hay on fire. And he's walking away. So I'm going to pick this up, since he's distracted, I'm going to pick up this. And I'm going to pick up uh, this key. I'm going to open this cabinet. It's empty. I'm going to read this flyer. A picture of a flagpole, but I can't read Nepal. Nepal Nepali? I'm gonna read Wanted Poster. I can't read, but there's a photo of a meteor on it. That's funny. Do you guys wanna see a Yoshi? I don't wanna see no Yoshi. What Yoshi? So we have to we had to get that guy away, right? Let's show him the crystal. <laughs> no thanks. Let's show him the book. Oh, I see you're a follower of the guru. You may enter. Okay, so we found a way in. You guys want to see a Yoshi look? There he is. <laughs> <clears throat> Nightbot is not dead. He's he's watching the game. Maybe you should do that, you know? All right, so let's read this flyer. I highly doubt he could read it, but let's read it. How to raise your consciousness and lower your goal, golf scores. Okay, so buy how you know buy his book. It's a flyer, available at airports around the world. So setting the thing on fire is to distract the guard in gray. A war to Swanee. How? Why well, I can't even read the name for a record shattering score of nineteen at Pebble Beach. I mean. Yeah, Pebble Beach. Okay, let's read this postcard. It's a picture of the African shaman and the guru playing golf. Okay. This guy, what? It's floating up. You 
kept yourself karmically clean and you have the blue crystal with you I will now teach you how to use it it will put you into a random state of no into a state of deep rampart with any animal simply focus one hour later then your then you swat swat it and yank yak butter with a clove of what oh my god two hours and he says that was no lady that was my wife get it ha 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 what is he talking about <laughs> three hours later and it only works if you are in contact with earth now go and do something good so he teaches you how to use the crystals he's some he look at that he's like he's a wizard or something because he's floating up in the air so now we know that the blue crystal is a crystal that lets you swap bodies with an animal that's very important to remember um so we've been there right is the is the haystack still on, f on fire you're a wizard harry yeah a wizard so this thing is still burning i feel bad for this guy okay so we're done here i don't even think we need a key but you know what rip okay we do have to come back here if we want to know the other crystals so the way you get back to the airport is um if you read the sign or a license plate yak1 insert cash card for airport transport so let's use the cash card on the yak Where the hell he swept the card? He went behind the yak and swept the card. A long dusty ride later. What the heck? Well then. I don't even want to know what he did. it back there <laughs> I know right okay so this is gonna be really expensive we have to go to um to um Egypt and then go back to oh my god did you see this yak smile for a second there <laughs> I mean, you know, he li he liked it. What am I doing? Okay, I was gonna save actually. He did smile. All right, let me read the card because I'm going broke. Yeah, he's going broke. Shoot, and a Jogo fight later. But then I have to go back to. Oh my god, it's so expensive. I gotta go back to Miami. Saving this for wusses. Listen, just because you're irresponsible in life, Gargan, doesn't mean everybody else has to be irresponsible. You don't save money? Because I'm pretty sure you do. Or you just waste it all. 
Okay. Let me read the card. I just wasted a lot of minutes. So let me save it again. Yes. Um, I'm gonna try to go to the Bermuda Triangle. Your money back? No. I already told you. It's. Uh, you want me to paste it again? Non-refundable. So, it's your problem. Okay, saving. One second. I'm going to see if I could go. Yes, okay, good, 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 good. That actually is really good. So let me switch to um side one. Love the train. You never know what to expect. That's why I gave you a shoot. Hey, I got a good one for you. You know why this is called a biplane? Because you never know. If it's coming back, oh nice. <laughs> you smile. Uh oh. Oh, oh, not again. Hey, what's happening? Everything's fading. The water below us is shimmering. I'm not supposed to come here. <laughs> I'm gonna load it again. I just I just realized something. I just realized something. Loading it again, sorry. I'm not supposed to go there. <laughs> oh, shit. It's going to crash. If you saw right there, I loaded because I'm not supposed to go there yet. I just remember. I'm supposed to go somewhere else. Um, I need to go to San Francisco actually. So, the biplane, you know that how there's rumors that when you go to the Bermuda Triangle, you disappear? Well, um, there's rumors that alien abduct, like they abducted you. So that's what happened. Um, I'm going to San Francisco, oh man, because I need to buy something in particular. I should have done this from the start. Let me let me read my my uh my card key again. Okay, I need to, yeah, I actually do need to go back to San Francisco. Let me read this really quick. Okay, I'm going to San Francisco because I need a toolbox. I have to get a toolbox. But I'm going back to that UFO. You'll see it. You'll see it. I just need to do certain things first. I'm running out of money. If I run out of money, it's game over. So I hope. I need to get the blue crystal, the, the yellow crystal. Shoot, I think I messed up. I wasted way too much money.
if I run out of money on Thursday, I'm gonna do this a little bit better, planning out a little bit better, and um, continue where I left off. So, cause I ran, I went to Nepal, right? I should have first went to him with all the um, the crystals, cause he'll tell me what each crystal does. But we'll see. We'll see what happens. All right. Okay. Buy toolbox. If this is way too expensive, then I have to. I have to do something. I have to play the game again. Forty-five dollars. Okay, that's not bad. It's not bad. Here's my cash card. Thanks. Here. Okay. So when I open this, I have a lot of stuff now. I have duct tape, monkey wrench, wire car cutters, rope. Which is good because I need all those I need all those um tools. So I'm gonna save it one more time. So now oh, my nose. Sorry about that. I'm going to do certain things now. I don't suggest you do this. Wait, 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 no, 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 Hello, close the door. All right. We know this door is closed because I think it says it's closed, if I remember correctly. Yeah. Permanently closed. So that means that they're not even coming back. Owner's locked out. So I'm going to use the wire cutters on this. Uh, Bobby pin sign. All right, so now I have that. I'm going to go back to my apartment. Oh man. Ugh. I swear, every time I stream, my nose start itching. Okay. I need it a lot, like man. I might have to start all over. So Guardian of the Galaxy 2. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna see it on Friday, hopefully. With a cousin. I'm not gonna say who, but I'm gonna watch it with the cousin. All right, I'm gonna open this cabinet, and I'm gonna use the monkey wrench on this. Yeah, I heard it's really good. I did that for a reason because I'm going to use the stale bread in the sink. And I'm going to push this button. Uh, use, I guess. Switch. Uh, push, switch. Hello. 
Oh, turn on switch. Whoops. So now we have breadcrumbs. Okay. I'm going to turn off this. Oh, not take off, turn off. Sorry. And I'm going to use the monkey wrench again on where's the monkey wrench? On the pipe. Bad by spoiler for you. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Use monkey wrench on pipe. Come on. Close cabinet. Now I'm going to use sushi in the sink. Hope you're happy there. You know it's kind of messed up though? Okay, you know how she's in the sink? I've done this by mistake too. You could turn on the, the shred, the... What is that called? You could turn on the switch and grind her up and kill her. Which is messed up, but you could do that. Like when she's in the sink, you could turn on the switch and then she'll get grind up and die. It won't be a game over, but it's kind of cruel. Alright, I'm gonna save it right now. Oh my god. <laughs> Alright. Oh my god. Okay. Sorry about that. Alright, uh, now that we have all those tools, um, let me read the cash card again. I'm running really low on money. He still has quite a bit, which is good. Okay, I gotta use the kazoo. You again. This, and there's a reason why I put her in the in the um in the sink. Any popcorn left? Yeah, there is. I haven't eaten dinner yet. I'll send you to the new the world. All right, so now, oh man, let me see where I could go. I don't think I have enough money. I really don't think I have enough money. Um, so we got a new location, Peru. Um, Um, what you might call it? We need to. No, I don't want to go to Peru. Oh man, I'm not gonna have enough money. Um, London is a place we do go to. If I'm around your hood Friday, you want to see it? Like again, I might see it with someone else. And nowadays, unfortunately, 
um, what you call it? Unfortunately, you have to order seats prior. I'm not gonna say her name. It's a her. Someone's sister. I'm, that's all I'm gonna say. I'm not gonna say the name. Um. Okay, we could go to Mex Mexico. I'm trying to remember where I need to go. Oh man, these are expensive. Let me save it. The same person. I my mom. You could come, but. Let me first speak to the person and then I'll let you know. No, it's not a date. It's a cousin, not a date. <laughs> it's a cousin. You know, I told you, know, you want to hear something funny though? I, I know I'm going, I'm, I'm like delaying the game. But you know what's funny? When I was like, yeah, I'm going to the movies with this person, my mom is like, why you don't just get a girlfriend already? So you could go to some movies with her instead. And I'm like, Ma, what the hell, Ma? <laughs> it's so funny. All right. I'm going to save it again. I know I probably saved it already. I'm going to go to Peru to see what happens. I'm going to go with someone else then. Dang. Um... Uh, it's okay, man. You didn't know. Um, again, Gargan, we could see it together, but I had to speak to the person first and then see what happens. What time are you gonna be here? Like, what are you gonna? When are you gonna be here on Friday? That's the thing. If you are here, like, what time? You know. All right. The reason why I see it is because I'm gonna go to Peru. I don't know what's in Peru. So hopefully it's something that I could do because it's an expensive ticket. All right, let's see. I swear if, I, if it's another one of those things, then I have to start over again. Can you pay for me? No, man, what the heck? Do I look like your bank? I'm not your bank. Okay. So we went, oh my God, this is, this is a little, it's confusing. Go during the week, find seats easier like I did. Oh, we went somewhere. Imagine I died. Yes, okay, 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 okay. Okay. This is actually good. This is a place I, I had to go. Ancient Incan bird feeder. Fill only with dried breadcrumbs. Now you know why we have breadcrumbs. And we had that crystal that lets us switch places with an animal. Right? So. I'm gonna use the breadcrumbs here since this is a bird feeder. Yeah, early in the morning or Saturday night or Sunday, cheap and good seats. No little bleep, bleeping kids, no bleeping annoying people. <laughs> 7 a.m. No, man, that's too early. What the hell? Okay, so we put the breadcrumbs there. This is why we needed the breadcrumbs. This is why we needed to grind them down so that uh, they become like that. <laughs> to get a perfume and have a sister who is in. Alright, so we got the bird there. We do know, however, I'm gonna say over here, that when we do use the crystal, that the the bad guys come. So I gotta do this really quick. So I'm gonna use the blue crystal on the bird. Mm -hmm. So we have to do this quick. 
Now we have control of the bird. Qué sucio, yo. You see right here? That's a huge carving of an alien. Don't ask me why, but apparently for for a bird this size, I could pick up this. Right? Okay, now what I'm gonna do is instead of going to the other place, I'm going to um, fly back to my body. Because remember, the guy could kidnap us. I'm gonna fly back here. and give the scroll to Zack. And now we're gonna switch back to Zack. That was an experience. And I'm gonna get out of here. Reporter becomes bird brain bird brained after trading mines with Sparrow. I left because I have to go to the other eye. I went to the left eye but I have to go to the right. Oh, no, wait. Yeah, no. You see, I'm screwing it up. I went into the right eye, and now I have to go to the left of the statue of the carving. So, the reason why I ran out is because the guy is going to come. He should be coming. So, I don't want to get caught because if I get caught, I get thrown. Something happens. Like, I get thrown in jail. And it, it's just an unknown process. So right now I'm just waiting. I have a sister. I'm not, I'm not, oh my God, man. I'm not even gonna say it. You see, you came. Zolf, fake, I missed him. Okay, so now I'm gonna go back in the into the uh oh shoot where the hell I think it's this way no I went to the airport no, 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 not the airport. I gotta go back to the, 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 the thingamajig. Okay, so it's not there. There's no way to, to uh, find out where, where you're going, by the way. You have to just go randomly. Don't tell me this is the airport. In the cave of solitude. <laughs> okay, we're here. Good, good, good. Okay. So, now we're gonna use the crystal again. Right? And we're gonna go to the left eye. Again, how the heck a bird carried a scroll? I don't know. Maybe in its feet? I have no idea. So we're gonna go to the right eye now. I mean left eye. And we're gonna pick this up. Oh wait, I think this is too heavy. Yeah, it's too heavy. Crap. Well, we got the scroll. We needed the scroll. All right. 
I might run out of money in the game. Phew. Alright. Gonna get out of here. So we can't pick up the chandelier. You gonna study? I'm almost ending, man. Relax. Okay? Take a chill pill. You're gonna fail anyways. Why study? You're gonna fail. You do horrible in school anyways. Alright. What I might do, because I'm not gonna finish. I'm not gonna finish. Today is I might pick this up at Thursday. Yeah, I'm not gonna finish today. Five more minutes. I stream at least three hours and some change. I'm not gonna finish this. It's gonna be a while before I finish this. And he's running out of money. This is why you gotta plan. You gotta have a basic idea of where to go before you start going all over the place. Cause I went to Egypt for no reason and that was like $2,000. So now I can only go to Mexico and San Francisco. I'm gonna save it here. A minus. Everyone say congratulations so bad. A minus is bad man, you should've got an A, not an A minus. Terrible student. Is your mother proud of you with that grade? Okay, let's see where Mexico leads us. <laughs> Watch me waste money. Okay. Don't tell me it crashed. Cause if it crashed, then I'll just stop. Now I think it. What happened? Oh, he can't. He's there. <laughs> You're an investment machine to the family. You're part of. <laughs> you should be banned from all future family events. It might as well. You should have. You have been disowned by all streamers present. You ain't nobody. <laughs> Damn, man. Okay. So, let's first check what's here. And then we'll... I'm gonna end the stream. What's <laughs> that? Cucaracha. Damn. Okay, I have no idea where I'm at. Alright, you know what? Hang on. I swear that freaking sound pops out of nowhere. It actually like, and then it like scares me. So, so I'm gonna save here. I'm gonna save here, correct? And um, well, it's saved. And I'm gonna end the stream right here. Um, let me play some music while I talk. Okay. Um, let me play... I'll play... This one? Well, no, I already played that one. Yeah, I'll play this one. Alright. So... I want to thank everybody for joining me. I appreciate it. Um... I'm gonna continue on Thursday. And it's gonna be around 8 o'clock as well. 8 o'clock uh, Easter Standard Time. So, again, thank you for all those who, watched, who, who are watching at the moment, all those who are watching the past, if they're seeing the past broadcast. And yeah, so thank you, thank you again, and I'll see you on Thursday. See you next time.